今次 Lacoste 珠寶藝術學院香港嘅第五次展覽帶嚟嘅主題係男士戒指 ，Eve Gusto 傳奇珍藏。Eve g a s t o 生前喺法國係一位著名嘅古董商人，佢生前嘅戒指收藏超過一千多隻。Extravagant and provocative in a way, wearing two to three rings on each hand at the same time and and wearing his rings every day. In Paris and around, he he was known as a dealer with a lot of tastes. It was really like a quest he had on on collecting rings. He went、uh, in many countries, and he would bring back、uh, a ring from each and every trip、um, along、uh, the journeys. He went also to the flea market.、Uh, he would go to jewelry workshops as well. He would purchase from auction houses. He knew a lot about history, about all the symbolism of the different patterns and motifs that you can find on a ring. These two rings are the rings of the 19th century Wallis Gold Gold. It is actually preserved by the Qing Dynasty of the Qing Dynasty. 你睇到四面咧，都镶嵌咗呢个红玉水雕刻嘅宝石。总督戒指系身份嘅象征，亦都系权力嘅象征。正面系真系可以打开，打开咗之后，中间嘅暗格可以放药物、香料，甚至乎系毒药。One very remarkable、uh, piece in the collection and in this、uh, exhibition is the angel、uh, ring. It, it was、uh, crafted by the house of Duponchel and Company in, in 1850.、Uh, it was used as a seal、uh, in the old days and, and, and bearing、uh, two angels on, on the flanks. It's, it's made of yellow gold, silver, and lapis lazuli. One of the angels is.、Um, uh, Is holding a cross and the、uh, the other uh, one uh, a sword, and and it's、um, also engraved uh, uh, with a, an inscription meaning with the help of God. It's very very rare uh, piece, uh, a collector's one, and, and it shows、um, how acute、uh, the the taste of、uh, if guess who was when it comes to rings. The English morning ring.、Uh, it was、uh, this one dates back to the 19th century, but it's it's a tradition which started in the 16th century in England. So this ring is is very special and and quite unique because because it's not only bearing the symbol of、uh, of the passing of the loved one, but also a body part because it's set with. Uh, a piece of hair from the deceased person, which was a way、uh, to keep the memory alive of that uh, beloved uh, person who was gone. We offer a journey、uh, through different chapters: history, Gothic, Christian, mystic, vanitas, and eclecticism. He was very visionary in a way、um, that,、uh, to him, gender or, or the classic way of thinking about gender didn't really matter. It was all about the beauty. Of the silhouette, the beauty of the person, and the beauty of the of the rings, and he revived in a way the fact that rings were were first worn by、uh, male in history in very very ancient times.、Uh, male were were the first to wear、uh, rings because of symbols of of power, because of of symbols of faith. Uh, uh, as amulets, and and it's only in very recent history that ladies started wearing rings. 
我哋相信呢度咁多件嘅收藏品，对于 Eve Gusto 嚟讲，都有不同嘅故事，有不同嘅回忆。我哋希望嚟参观嘅观众都可以嚟亲自发掘。Uh, not only、uh, people who are、uh, interested in in high jewelry or feminine jewelry, but but really everyone who、um, has the opportunity to、uh, to wear a ring,、uh, whatever their generation or, or style.